Uh, hi, uh, Atlanta to Dallas Aviation back again uh, for what's potentially part two of my unboxing uh, and combined with a number six fleet video. Um, I'm going to see if I can combine this video with the uh, video of the other five planes that I just made. Um, but my computer is is a putz and the software I use is probably a little bit slow too so I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to even simply combine the two videos so uh, this might be a separate video or it might not be uh, however as you can see here are the models we have already these are the models we've already unboxed. Uh, the Cathay Pacific L-1011. The Aegean Airbus A321neo. The uh, Air Transat uh, A321neo. The Southwest Boeing 737 MAX 8 in the spirit livery uh, and dedicated to Colleen Barrett and the Avianca A320 uh, with the CFM 56 engines uh, in the uh, Laxa I sure hope I'm saying that I'm sure I'm butchering it but Laxa uh, retro um, or heritage livery which is there back there on the tail So without further ado, to the last um, plane to unbox uh, and the next plane to that would be featured in a fleet video is my Air Greenland Airbus A330-200, also NG models, and this registration is Oscar Yankee dash Golf Romeo November and the NG uh, item number there is 61056 and let's get into this one and these boxes are so tight I always end up bending them I mean I'm not that worried about bending them up uh, but I really would prefer not to <laughs> so anyway now this particular uh, this particular A330 200 has been retired and returned to the lesser l-e-s-s-o-r lesser I think think is how you say it uh, and uh, when Air Greenland had this plane it was their only A330 and uh, their only A330 now that replaced this one was an A330-800neo so they do have the more fuel efficient uh, A330 still in their fleet uh, but uh, hopefully uh, that one will be put out too and I can and I can use that one in any airport updates I might do but Air Greenland has mostly um, prop jobs if I remember correctly I think they're ATR 42s or 72s I think and I think they even have like a like a private jet type uh, airplane so but anyway let's take a look at this one for <laughs> fleet video number six and the continuation of unboxing number 13 
So it looks like uh, the winglets there say Air Greenland on the inside of the winglet. I think it's just, no, it says it on the outside of the winglet too. I just can't, the angle I'm at, I'm at with my camera and where I'm sitting, I couldn't quite see it. So I was reading a little bit about um, this livery and they're calling, if I read correctly, they're calling this pattern here on the tail and, uh, oh shoot, now I forgot what it was, ice, was it just ice flower? Or was it a specific flower? Well, anyway, I think it was ice flower. Um, so that's what that's supposed to be. Let's get our up close and personal here. So we got our air Greenland written down there below the uh, window line, the L1 and L2 door there. We have our Air Greenland with the uh, ice flower emblem on the engine cowling there. Let's see, the inside of the winglet, which I do believe says Air Greenland on it. I can't quite see it on my little bitty screen, but I'm pretty sure that's what it says. And then we can... Ah, okay, I guess I'm going to have to like do this to see the underside. Okay, can you see the underside there? It's probably not in focus. Let's see if we can get it to focus. Hello, can you focus for me? No, I guess not. It actually didn't like that one bit. <laughs> All right, so anyway, there is your registration. And I don't know what that writing is right above those windows. Maybe it's Airbus A330. I'm not sure what that. I can't quite see it. And then there's the ice flower on the tail. All right, so that officially does it for me. Um, I hope you enjoyed uh, both videos since I'm probably going to have to uh, post them separately and uh, if you did like them please subscribe and uh, give me a like please um, and I will see you uh, the next time I have something interesting to show you. Bye.